Okay, so uh, today I'm on my way to go get. Uh, well, it's just shaking it. Today I'm on my way to go get a solar panel and uh, hopefully a battery and charge controller from a place that I've been recommended by a friend of mine, Paul, um, called Richards Off Grid, which is in Retford. <coughs> so I'm going to go there, try and get a solar panel, and uh, I'll keep you updated on how that goes. I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Okay, so I got a solar panel. Uh, I didn't buy the charge controller or batteries because uh, it didn't have the charge controllers in stock and the batteries weren't what I expected. They were forklift truck batteries and bloody massive. I don't think I need that kind of... Well, I don't have the space for that anyway. So, in the back of here is a whopping great solar panel and it was, it's 270 watts, which I think will be all right. If not, I can always add to it. Um, but 100 quid. I don't think I'm going to be able to grumble at that. I'll probably still grumble, because 100 quid's 100 quid, but I think the bargain for what it is. <coughs> um, so we will... Uh, I'm going to try and fit the panel to the roof today, uh, although it is raining, so I probably will give up very quickly on that. Try and fit the panel to the roof, and then uh, leave it for a bit. I'm not, uh, I've not got any of the cabling or anything. I'm going to try and get a charge controller off eBay. Um, and some batteries from somewhere. So I'll start fitting it, but I'll not have it hooked up yet. But then I've got to decide whether I'm gonna have that, try and convert everything to 12 volt on the boat, more or less, or set the, set the, set the, solar, blah, 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 blah. Set the solar up to 240, so it's got a power inverter. I'm not 100% sure on that one yet. But anyway, I'll check back with you and I'm sure that we will have a fun adventure trying to fit this bloody thing. See you soon. Okay, so as you've just seen, uh, I'm just fitting a solar panel to the roof. <laughs> cable tied it to the roof with some big massive cable ties, which it's never gonna move off there. It's not under any sort of, any load. It's not, the boat doesn't go fast enough for it to lift off. 
the wind's not going to pick that up. Those are some big ass cable ties. Anyway, the holes were already drilled. It bolts straight to rails, and that's it. So I didn't even have to drill anything. So that is perfect as far as I'm concerned. Um, just got to wait to try and find a charge controller uh, and some batteries, and then that's it. Solar panelled up. I, I may even buy it. Thinking about it, I may even buy another solar panel the same size as that one. So then I've got some big ass solar panels, and that will be like almost 600 watts which again <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what that means <laughs> 600 watts sounds like it it's a lot uh so hopefully that should power everything in the boat i just need to find some to find some big ass batteries as well that'll be good anyway thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed this and i'll keep you updated on the uh keep you updated on the uh solar panel journey uh as soon as i get all the other bits i'll keep you updated and hopefully I should be able to pull that together quite easy. Anyway, thanks for your patience in waiting for these vlogs to come out. And thanks for your interest. I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.